everyone, I am going to tell you the story of a tiny squid from the movie Toy Story. Alright everyone, coast clear, yelled Woody. Andy, the boy who played with them, had gone off for his school. And the toys were in a mood to play. Woody had an idea. Let's play a game I made up. It's called Sardines. It's where one person finds a hiding place and hides there. When another person finds the hider, he will hide with the hider too. The, f the last one who finds the bunch of hiders, the last, will be the one who will be the hider in the next round of the game. They decided that Ham, the piggy bank, would be the hider. He scrambled off. And the toys started counting from 1 to 25. 20, 21, 22, 23. Ham heard this and quickly crammed himself into the only thing closest by. Andy's old lunchbox, which was a bad thing because it was a bit squishy. The first person to find Ham was Woody. He entered and shut the lid. Next, Jessie found them. He crammed inside and managed to close the lid. Here, you won't find us. But Buzz Lightyear located them. Now there were four toys in a tiny lunchbox and were getting crammed. Buzz couldn't even close the lid. So, the rest of the toys came. Unfortunately, I included Rex the dinosaur. They were too crammed. Rex's tail was still visible. So all the toys crammed there and had quite a tight squeeze. Ugh. Not quite a thing you would like to do on a day where you're wanting, planting to have fun. Ow. Wait, is the lunchbox muffling my balls? Must be. And so all the toys came out. Finally, Woody rubbed his eyes. They had been crammed. Then he asked Ham, Gosh, Ham, couldn't you have found a more spacious place? Yeah, probably, said Ham. But it's a, it's in a game called Sardines. And if, if you want to play Sardines, why don't you get crammed like Sardines in a tin? Now the toys listened to Han and decided it was a nice way to play the game. And so, and so, next time onwards they chose a smaller place to hide, just to keep it exciting. I hope you enjoyed the story. Thank you.